So here you have a bit of a horse track. So if you try that. You can also try a bit here. Is there a bit more straight? Yeah. Now I have the four wheel drive. Maybe you can feel the difference if you try this one. You want to? This one is a four wheel drive. This is the four wheel drive. So the difference you will feel is that this one slides a bit when you steer and this keeps on steering. So you can do a small uh, turning wheel. Oh yeah, it, it's yeah, it, it pops. Yeah. <laughs> this one has a 1400 watt motor and this one is 1400 watt plus 500 additional. And that's the benefit of these large wheels and the suspension, that you can uh, do this kind of uh, underground routes. And this is actually where Scoozy is made for, for this kind of environment. To really go into the forest, enjoy nature and, and uh, cover more distance. So, uh, in, like in Paris, we were in the city center there with Scoozy and then in 30 minutes you can go from South Paris to North Paris. And then you drive everywhere on bike lanes, pavement. So this is the only electric vehicle out there in the market that can drive anywhere and park anywhere and go indoor and outdoor. There's oh. no other product. Indoor? Yeah, so like in a shopping center. Really? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. In France? Uh, yeah, and I was in Spain, in Madrid, in a shopping center. And because it's a medical device, you can drive in pedestrian oh, yeah. areas, you can drive on the curb, uh, on the sidewalk, on the bike the lane. The speed will be like six. Yeah, so that's why we have two speed modes, drive and speed. So drive is more the pedestrian speed, and speed is up to like a bike speed. And then you can choose them. Okay, both using like the bike lane and the indoor way. Yes. Yeah. So that's the fun part of this vehicle. So if you would like, for instance, take a scooter, normal scooter, two wheel, you cannot drive in a pedestrian area. You cannot right. drive uh, uh, on the sidewalk. Right. You cannot drive indoor. And that's what this product all can do because it's a medical device. And this is what our customers love, especially if they have a dog and they go outside and uh, just enjoy nature. And that's also, so I think like uh, compared to Will, uh, Will is of course is perfect for uh, uh, really indoor and also way more maneuverable. Uh, and this is more uh, used instead of a bike and maybe even like instead of a car. Uh, yeah. A bit different use case. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, so here you have the, the D mode, so that's like sure. more just pedestrian speed. And then uh, this is for on the sidewalk. Right. And then and they also have like four user levels that you can uh, switch different speeds. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, okay. So, uh, for in France, for instance, the top speed is not faster allowed than uh, uh, 10 kilometers per hour. So we can program that and then you can choose a different, so they can do it like this. Oh, okay. And then if, you're now in level three, two, one. And that mm -hmm. sets the maximum speed for both drive and speed. And maybe you, you felt it, but um, uh, the steering envelope is uh, connected to the speed. So the faster you go, the larger your turning radius. So when you drive like uh, 18 kilometers per hour and suddenly move the joystick, uh, then the speed will go down and you, it lets you steer gradually more and more.
Yeah, that was for us the main challenge to um, uh, to have the suspension in the front, but right. still keep a flat surface and keep enough uh, leg room. Yeah. So we managed to get that very compact mm -hmm. and still have enough ground clearance. But you still have like. A... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I feel like I'm quite suspect. Yeah. Here, both sides. Yeah. And this uh, four-wheel drive, so this is a prototype, uh, and it's uh, dynamic. So the more power you ask from the rear motor, the more it will give to the front. What about this one? This is a isolation This uh, insurance. It's a liability insurance. Uh, so in the Netherlands, you need uh, to have an insured liability insurance, uh, but it's not like that you have a type approval or something. Sorry. Uh, so that's uh, just a way that they can see that you're insured. Yeah, but in, in Germany, for instance, it's different again. In, right. And in France, I don't think you need it. In the UK as well, you don't need it. So that's for rice and So this is uh, medically certified as a, a mobility scooter. But of course, it's more a hybrid between a powered wheelchair and a mobility scooter. Yeah, 100 kilometers. 100 kilometers. With two batteries, two batteries. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 48 volts. And then uh, 33 amp hours. And because of the 48 volts, you have less uh, loss in your system, less resistance. Open up, and then you have some uh, a bit more space to go get out. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. cannot go out in the front, so we <laughs> open up the wheels. 